digestion. It's one of those things we don't think too much about until it goes awry. And then we can't think about much else. So today we're talking about digestion, a churning question. Over 10 million Americans suffer from chronic GI problems. That includes functional bowel disorders like irritable bowel syndrome, constipation, diarrhea, and bloating. GI tract disorders can indicate other serious conditions, so always work with your healthcare team for diagnosis and treatment strategies. There's a natural symphony of chemicals in the stomach region that balance our emotions, sleep, pain, and energy. A healthy stomach is actually essential to keep the precise balance of chemicals for optimal mental as well as physical health. Your activity level, mental state, and diet all affect digestive health. Let's look at a few digestion basics for better gut health. Dietary fiber reduces the risk of gastritis and aids gut bacteria and intestinal cells, reducing the risk for inflammatory bowel disease. The type of food we eat influences the microbiome, or gut bacteria. Healthy gut bacteria thrive on fiber, vegetables, fruits, whole grains, beans, and nuts. Harmful bacteria thrive on sugar, junk food, fried food, and animal fat, causing inflammation and increased risk for numerous diseases. The saying goes, eat breakfast like a king, lunch like a queen, and supper like a pauper. Regularity is key. Eat plenty of fresh fiber foods only at mealtime. Let your stomach rest between meals and eat much less for your third meal. Here's one, slow down. Slower eating is linked to better digestion, nutrient availability, fewer calories consumed, and improved mental function. Slow down. Turn off the media and enjoy your meal with others whenever possible. Reduce portions. Eating just a little bit less than completely full reduces bloating, aids digestion, and even extends life. Overeating and inactivity combined create sluggish circulation, sluggish thinking, fatigue, sour stomach, and sour mood. Replenish and charge your system with water. Drinking water between meals instead of taking a lot of fluid with meals leaves room for healthy choices and improves digestive activity. Drink a nice big glass of water when you wake up in the morning to charge your system for the day. Emotional health is strongly linked with digestive health. Chronic stress, anxiety, and depression cause so many stomach ailments. The entire digestive system is closely attuned to a person's emotions and state of mind. Therefore, what affects the stomach will directly affect the brain and vice versa. Nearly every chemical that controls the brain is also located in the stomach region. Just as the brain can upset the gut, the gut can also upset the brain. Finally, manage stress. Managing stress, nixing caffeine and alcohol, and getting rest all ease anxiety and lower stress-related digestive problems. Light exercise, especially outdoors before or after meals, also aids digestion and eases anxiety. The Bible teaches that there is a time and a season for all things, a divine purpose for every stage of life. Jesus is inviting you now. Behold, I stand at the door and knock. If anyone hears my voice and opens the door, I will come into him and dine with him and he with me. Eating good food in regular patterns aids digestive health. Feeding on the Word of God eases life's worries and leads to eternal life. It's a winning combination for better gut health and peace of mind. <music>